Okay, hi kindergartners. Today we're going to be uh, making a painting of a heart for Valentine's Day. And uh, we're going to be using the style of pointillism like we learned about today. George Surratt um, used many, many, many dots to make his paintings. Um, and we're gonna do the same thing. If you're at home today and you don't have paint, that's okay. You can use um, a crayon or marker to make your dots instead. Like if I had a heart here and maybe you have markers at home, we could do something like this where you're making many dots with the marker. Um, or if you have crayons, you can do it with crayons too, where we're using many, many dots to fill in our drawing. But the kids at school today are going to be using paint. So uh, we're all gonna do the same first steps. So one, two, three, all eyes on my screen. Let's begin. You will need a piece of paper and say it with me, kindergartners. The first thing we do is always the same. Take your paper and write your, right. So let's put our name on the back, please. Write your name on the back in big letters, please. And then flip over your paper. Uh, so if you're at home, just do your best to follow along. Like I said, we can use markers to make our dots instead of paint, but the kids at school are going to be using paint. So the first thing we're going to do all together is we're going to draw our heart. So let's make two dots, one at the bottom and one almost at the top. Two dots. Then we're going to connect those dots with a big curving line. So look, my line is going to curve up and then bend down and come right down to that other dot that we made. Good, now we have half of the heart. Let's do that on the other side too. So we'll bend our line up and coming down. Doesn't have to be perfect. Look, my line's a little shaky. That's okay if yours is too. So now we can get started. If you're at school, like I said, we're gonna use paint. So here's how I want you guys to do this today. We have uh, red, white, and blue, very patriotic colors. Let's start with our uh, red paint. And when you use your brush, only use the tip of the brush when you poke it down to the paper. So I'm just going with the tip of my brush and I'm poking it down to the paper. And I'll start making my dots. And go little bits at a time. I'm going to go kind of fast so that you guys can have plenty of time to work today. But that's all we're doing. We're using dots. And I want you guys to go slow and take your time. And let's see what happens first, or kindergartners, if we mix our red and white. What color do you think it'll make if I mix red and white? Let's see. I mixed my red and white and it made the red a lot lighter and now we have pink. So I can use that color too. I can take lots of dots here and I'll make my heart red and pink full of dots. Once we do that and once you have most of the space filled, you don't want to do too much. I want to be able to see your dots. So don't add too many dots. And remember, just use the tip of your brush to poke. Once you've done that, we can swish our brush and clean it off in the water. When your brush is all clean, grab some blue and let's make our dots in the background too. Okay, if you finish early, what can I do if I finish early, Mr. Santos? If you're at home, um, you can make another one or um, explore the choice board in our Google Classroom. And if you're at school, if you finish early, uh, we're going to put our wet artwork on the drying rack so that it can dry nicely uh, before we collect them. Okay, um, so again, if you're at home and you don't have paint, that's okay. I don't expect you guys to have all the supplies all the time. You guys can use markers or crayons to make a drawing of a heart and fill it in using many, many, many dots. Okay, and how cool is that, you guys? Let's go ahead and begin. If anybody needs me and you're at home, just come off of mute and say, excuse me, and I'll be around to help you guys. So that is pointillism, painting with dots. Have fun, everybody.